Okay, so now I'll be going over what you can do for your hermit crabs when you're going away on vacation so that you don't have to find someone to take care of them for you. This video is part of a series of videos about me telling you what you can do for your pets during vacation. I've already made a hamster one, tropical fish, beta fish, and now we're doing hermit crabs. So you'll find all those videos in the playlist that is in the description. Now I will tell you what you can do for your hermit crabs so that you won't have to find someone to take care of them. So hermit crabs need a source of heat, whether that's a light that gives them heat in their tank or an actual heater on their tank. So either way, those two things need to be run by electricity. So what you can do is buy an outlet that has a timer on it. If you are using a heater, it can probably run all the time so you don't need to buy a outlet with a timer but if you have a light on your tank which is also the tank's heat source then you should buy a outlet with a timer and plug that into there set it to where it will turn on in the morning and off at night and as for humidity you can put some moss in their tank like some frog moss that you get from the store just get it wet and Put it in one of their hides and that'll be a good humid place for them to go to but it may not be enough humidity so you're probably gonna have to buy a humidifier those can be pretty expensive and they don't really come with timers they just come with valves where you can choose how much mist comes out of it so if you want your mister to last a week or a few days then you should buy its own outlet timer. Not the kind of timer where it turns on in the morning and off at night. It has to be the kind of timer where it can uh, turn on and off throughout the day. So a digital timer like this one, for example, would be good. You just plug it into your outlet, your regular outlet on your wall, and then plug in your humidifier to it and set it to mist or spray your tank every hour or every two hours. And Having a timer will let the water in the mister last a lot longer and you won't over humidify your tank. As for drinking water, you can buy a mini dog bowl that comes with a water bottle attached to it so it's a refilling dog bowl. So you can buy like a mini one, maybe a cat one and put that in your tank for your hermit crabs. Uh, your hermit crabs can go a few days or maybe even weeks without a salt water bath because hermit crabs don't really like getting wet so they don't take baths often so they'll be fine without it for a few days and as for shells I'm sure they can stick with the shells they're in for a few days as well in case the shells in their shell pit get dirty while you're away also make sure to clean them before you leave if a humidifier is too expensive you can also buy a refilling dog water bottle and buy one of those really miniature humidifiers and attach one of those mini humidifiers to a timer outlet. Put that in the dog bowl so that it won't run out of water and it'll also be able to turn off and on so it doesn't put too much humidity in the tank and so that it doesn't use up all the water that's in the dog water bowl. So that's a cheaper idea to give them humidity. Also make sure your hermit crabs have no way of escaping while you're gone. And as for food, hermit crabs can go weeks to even months without food because when they molt, they don't eat for months. But that doesn't mean you should not give them food for several days. Food in a hermit crab tank can easily grow mold on it. So you can put dry food in there, food that doesn't usually get moldy. I don't know if there's such a food you can try hermit crab food from the store. That's all dried food. Test it out, see if it grows mold. If it doesn't, then you should be all right. You could also buy a cuddle bone in the bird section, put it in their tank for them to munch on, especially if one comes up from the surface while you're gone. A cuddle bone for them to munch on will give them some calcium. You can also scatter millet seeds in their tank. They will most likely grow into plants and then the hermit crabs can eat those plants. So instead of it growing moldy, it will actually grow into a plant. So millet seeds are a good idea for food. But that's pretty much it for ideas on what you can do for your hermit crabs when you are going away. If you can accomplish all those things, maybe buy a humidifier and everything, then uh, you should be good for going away a few days to maybe even a week.
But yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.